puts it out of play. John Williams is getting excited. Now we'll see them. So here comes Jordan Zamora. Well, first of all, just 16 years of age. Here's a name for your notebook. A Johnny Virtual of Bermudan descent. A proud moment coming on for Junior Stanis. That's a gives him a huge hug. Jordan Zamora is also coming on to make his league debut. An international flavour for the Cherries. They bring on a man from Bermuda and a man from Zimbabwe. Adam Smith also getting rested for these last few minutes as well. He runs across specifically to give Virtual a high five and a, a pat on the shoulder. And Adam Smith now. Well, welcome on Jordan Zamora for his league debut. And now they've got to get a touch. Well, there's, a, I guess, a moment to note down in your book, as we say. Ajani Birchill. He's about, looks about five foot six. He looks particularly slight. He's gone into play just behind Sam Surridge. He's already pursuing the ball down. As we say, there are some very big clubs monitoring a Johnny Birchall. Well, he's going to be a box of tricks, otherwise, if you're that small, you ain't got a chance. Well, he's on, and he's got a chance. And again, Jason Tindler's been very happy to just keep these guys motivated, I guess, in training and show them the opportunity is there. Three minutes to play. BBC Radio Solo, Bournemouth 5, Huddersfield nil. Kelly chasing on down this near side. Pritchard, who's been at Huddersfield for several seasons now. It's going to be a chasing afternoon for him, I'm sure, and for... Carlos Corbran, his heaviest defeat as a manager, as the ball is with Diara for Huddersfield here, who are just looking to get something on the score sheet. Bakuna over to the left hand side now, an opportunity for Critchlow, the substitute. In fact, it's not Critchlow coming across the field in the end, it's Mbenza who picked it up. Sorry, now Pritchard has it into the feet of Diara again. Right hand side of the penalty in a row, Huddersfield just going sideways, Jordan Zamura fronting up there, a little pocket of space found by. Vallejo in the centre, now over to the left-hand side, this is Critchlow. All of the substitutes getting involved for Huddersfield, they've used all five, as have the Cherries now. Full raft of ten, at Solent Sport on Twitter for your verdict of this one, 8-1-3 on text. As the Cherries consolidate second place in the table, heading into a home game here against Wickham on Tuesday in front of 2,000. Vallejo out to this right-hand side once more on Rowe. All of this is 30 yards to the Bournemouth goal, going sideways but not forward. Eventually Rowe plays a sideways cross and has got over everybody. And a chance for Jefferson Lerma out on that right-hand side to make his way forward. I think he's playing right-back now, Jefferson Lerma. The Cherries don't seem to have a right-back. Uh, it's back to the goalkeeper, Josh Schofield, uh, sorry, Ryan Schofield at the other end anyway. And Huddersfield will bring it away. In the back. Chris. Well, I think Jefferson Lerma has dropped in at right back below as Adam Smith's gone off. The ball is uh, with Steve Cook at the heart of the Cherries' defence at the moment. A proud captain, I'm sure. Here's Dan Gosling through the centre. Now here's the first chance for Birchall on the ball. He's fought, uh, pushed over. He wins a free kick straight away for the challenge by Dia Carvey. One contribution, one free kick, one from Ajani Birchall. Oh, I wish he could have just run on with it a little bit. I think he could have got a shot away. Well just needed that bit more sort of belief in the and confidence there to get the ball and just go for it but certainly I think you could see through the centre just a few strides there what he might have in his locker Cherry's got a free kick here now Stanislas has gone off Rico is not involved Brooks has gone off so Roro Raquel May has got himself over this set piece he's yeah. about fifth in line normally well that's Left what Roro center. has got in his locker well, it's going to need some real Roro behind this if he's going to score from here. It's 30-plus yards out, left of centre, but at 5 nil up with 20 seconds left, why not have a pot shot? I think he might do here. Let's try and take the roof off the Vitality Stadium. Raquel May does, and he goes with the kitchen sink, and unfortunately, he was way off target over the bar. Yes, didn't really catch that one at all, did he? Four minutes extra. We've just had a signal from our friend to the left with a bet on 5 nil. To say this is going to be a long four minutes. <laughs> <laughs> is, is